Well, hey friends, and welcome to my updated office. It's been a hot minute since I have shared an office tour with you guys. I know if you guys watch my vlogs, you've kind of seen that a little bit. My office is not done yet, but I did promise you guys an office update, and today is finally the day that I share it. So let me flip you guys around and I will talk about everything, and I'll probably link some products down below too if you all are interested. So without further ado, let's look at the progress of the office. All right, so when you first walk in, here is the office. Um, first things first, the desk is from Ikea. I got the really long top. Um, I don't remember the exact names of things, but again, I will either link them or write them down below for you guys. I got my chair from Amazon. I will link this. I do not remember what the brand name was, but it was uh, fairly inexpensive and it had really good reviews. It was okay to put together. There was a little mishap, but that's all right. I got it figured out. It's very, very comfortable. So on the right hand side, because I know you guys are going to be interested in the organization, this may change a little bit. Um, to the right hand side, I have all of my blue pens and things like that. I also have my um, handy dandy stapler, which is kind of awesome, and a bunch of other things. There's a Doyle dog. <laughs> and then next one down. I have lots of other things. I've got stuff for like packaging up, um, stuff from my Etsy store, my business cards. I've got like a little three hole punch guy there as well and another charger for my laptop. And I've got a whole bunch of things in here. I don't know, just a bunch of, just a bunch of clips and things. I don't know. Doyle, what do you think? <laughs> This stuff may change, um, and I don't think I've filled up everything. Yeah, and then this is just one of those paper cutters, and I think I just have paper down here. Yeah, I just have paper down here. All right, and then moving on to the next side here. This is all of my, like, colorful pens, things that I would use for, like, a pen test or things like that. So this is kind of like a seldom-used drawer for me, but I do have a few different things in here. I also have this fun little tape measure, which actually comes in really handy here. I do have a, it's hard to see, but I do have a ruler, but this comes in really handy up here. I use it like all the time. Um, and then in here, got nothing. And oh, a lot of these drawer organizers I either got from the container store many, many years ago, or like home goods. Um, a lot of these clear organizers I got from there. Yep, more clear organizers that I don't have anything in. And then this is kind of my nail polish collection right over here. I weeded that down a little bit. And then um, just some extra things for nails. And then nothing. That's it. What do you think, Doyle? Doyle's favorite spot, by the way, is right there on that heat vent. <laughs> and as for the top organization, I just have like a little pad of paper, a coaster for when I bring my water up here. I've got my laptop. I also have, like this is for my camera to import footage. Got my cell phone, hi. This, I'm not sure, okay, so here's my debate. Uh, I haven't done like an empties video in forever, so I'm kind of like collecting my trash. If you guys want to see an empties video, let me know. So I'm just kind of like collecting things over here. This is my printer. I also got this off of Amazon. This is the HP Color Laser Jet Pro. Um, I love it, it's so, so nice and it actually, um, like, you can scan and stuff too. Um, I got this white file cabinet also from Ikea. It was so easy to put together. I was very, like, pleased with it. Um, you can lock it if you want. I just leave the key there. And I've only filled up, this is like my personal, that's for business, and then the bottom one has nothing in it at the moment. Um, I also, funnily enough, um, mounted a big power strip over here. So I don't know, I kind of like that, that is kind of hidden. And then I also have, this is like the manual to this, um, but I also have my paper shredder over here as well. And I think I got my paper shredder on Amazon. If I did, I'll link it. And then from the corner, moving on over here, Doyle is right there again. I got this little basket at Marshall's I think a long time ago. I have a little pillow in there at the moment. I don't know what I want to do with that pillow, but it's just in there. I got this this organizer and then that organizer. Here, I'll go over here a little bit. Um, at like a Marshall's TJ Maxx somewhere in there, but I really like them. I currently have some planners in here. This is my 
address book. This is my budget planner and then this is my business planner. My daily Erin Condren life planner is downstairs at the moment because I just filmed a plan with me video today. Um, this I actually got from ErinCondren.com and it is one of their signs. So the thing I really want to do with this space is I want to put a shelf up here. I actually have the shelf but I want to paint my shelf. It's like negative 17 degrees today in Minnesota, so um, I can't really paint in the winter time. So um, I wanna put this shelf up here, but um, hopefully this summer that'll happen, but it'll just go like right there. Anyway, and then over here, I have a notebook for work, and then I've got some other work things, um, and then I've, I don't know, I've just got some like clipboards and some like, random poly envelopes for things. Oh, whoops, that just fell behind. Oh well, I'll get it in a minute. Um, but yeah, the idea is this will be completely clear and then everything will be up on the shelf when I get to it. So, fun things are inside of these cabinets. These are the Billy bookcases with doors. I can't remember what the doors are called. I think it's like Something that starts with an L, I, I cannot remember, but it's what goes with the Billy bookcases if you want doors on them. The hardware I actually got from Marshalls. It did not come with this hardware, but um, I really like how it turned out. So I have a lot of stuff for my shop in here. So um, I've just got some packaging things and more packaging things and paper. I've got my scale there, an old laptop that I need to figure out what to do with. Um, I've got my light box right there and a few other things and then all bubble mailers down there of a few different sizes. So that is what's in here. And in this one is all of my washi for my shop plus a ton of room to grow. I, when I purchased these cabinets, I believe they only came with two shelves. So I actually bought extra shelves and you can put in as many shelves as you want because over here, um, you know, you can put in what you need. So anyway, but then this is kind of my organization that I use for my shop. And then I have like, you know, it coded with what it is. So yeah, it works out really well. I actually filled a bunch of orders today. So that is this section of the room. And then moving on over here, I have like a little calendar thing that I have not updated for a few months. I've got another whiteboard as well. And then this is Doyle's spot. Yeah, this chair I actually got from Target.com. I really, really like it. Um, I like the legs and all of that too. This blanket is uh, Barefoot Dreams I got at Nordstrom many a couple years back. And then also this pillow was part of a bedding set that I had from Target, I wanna say like six or seven years ago, but I still really like it. So I don't know, I just kept it. And this is where Doyle sits when I work from home. So if I'm working from home, he usually sits right there or he'll sit on the heat vent. So yeah, this was just a quick look at the office progress. Oh, I forgot to share. Um, hoo -hoo. I don't know if this is gonna go very well. Okay, so these curtains my mom made for me. Um, the rod is from Target, but the curtains are from Ikea, but she shortened them. Also, these little spotlights are from Ikea as well, and I've got another one right over there. I think that's it. If you guys have any questions, feel free to put them down below and I will answer as many of you as I possibly can. Um, like I said, I will link as much as I can down below as well. But um, yeah, there's some definite progress I wanna do with this room. I wanna paint out the trim, paint the door, um, you know, put that shelf up over here. I don't know what I wanna do on this wall, if anything, I don't know. If you guys have ideas, let me know. I do have some like artwork and stuff I could put up there, but I don't know, like in an office, I feel like, you know, plain and simple is like the best idea, but I don't know. What do you guys think? Doyle and I are gonna go. So thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you in the next video. Bye guys. Well folks, it's time to kick it old school. Uh, so you could be